welcome to a brand new vlog y'all so we are like out and about right now um and basically i just came from starbucks and i did get my nails done today they look really cute it's like a natural color and like a little almond shape so i did get my nails done today and also i got my feet done um right now what i want to do is i want to go to target um i leave tomorrow to go out of town and basically, I want to go to Target because I got these little uh, gray sweatpants in a large. But I want to see if like an extra large fit more comfortably. Um, the large fits good um, for like my little airport outfit. I want to see if I can find an extra large because where I got the large ones at, they didn't have a little extra large or whatever. So I'm out at this other one or whatever. But yeah, we got our nails done today. I pretty much already pre-packed yesterday. We leave tomorrow, which tomorrow's date is, let's see, October 3rd. So we're leaving October 3rd. Um... I'm not sure when I'll get this vlog out to you guys, but I know October 3rd we are leaving. Um, so yeah. But basically, um I just got distracted, y'all. Hold on. Yeah, so basically we are about to go ahead and hit the target and then we're gonna go to the house. Uh I just got like some little last minute stuff to do. I might make a little box pizza tonight. Um, and just kind of just get everything together and probably just like finish packing with y'all stuff like that The time right now is actually six o'clock. It's right at six o'clock. So And it's Sunday Uh, we leave tomorrow, which is Monday. We're about to go ahead and hit the target. Um, I just ended up getting me this, um, let's see. What is this called? It is the white This is the white mocha with caramel drizzle uh, sweet foam and um, the decaf coffee so uh, this is my first time actually trying this kind it's actually really really good and then I end up getting me a ham and Swiss croissant as well um, I do have a new lens on the camera so like if it looks more wider like you guys can probably see more which I love um, yeah your girl got a new lens I um, actually end up getting it for my anniversary so Target had these for I think $40 and I had got these because I'm not about to be in the airport tomorrow with no slats on slab through the airport like uh -uh. plus it makes my feet hurt but anyways I got these cute little white little gym shoes from Target and I was like oh these are the perfect little shoes to wear to the airport tomorrow so I got some shoes to wear these are the wide legged um jogging pants they are in the gray and then they have the little wide leg so these are the ones that I actually want to see if I can get um, in an extra large these are actually 25 dollars so these are 25 dollars at target like i said a little bit on the expensive side i have seen them cheaper um so you can definitely get them you know cheaper or whatever but yeah we're about to go ahead and head out and head to target so i'll see y'all in a minute so we are dressed for today um i'll show you guys what i'm wearing here in a minute we do not have a full-size mirror in the room so i'm kind of like sorry about that but um i'll see if it's one downstairs so i can show you guys my outfit um i think i want to go to the black wall street mural first just to get that experience um it was a very devastating story behind it um and i just want to go learn more about what happened if you guys are not familiar with it um 
It's basically where it was like a massacre in um, Tulsa, where uh, they had like burned down like this like black community who had like built like their own like schools, churches, hospitals and everything. And it was on this street, I believe called Greenwood. So that's the street that it's on. And they ended up putting like a black Wall Street mural there. Um, I think uh, like tons of people had died and everything It's insane. Um, I didn't know about it until um we were actually coming down here so yeah um so yeah i want to go there visit that i think it happened back in like the 1920s or something 1921 that's most of the information that i know now but yeah it was just basically like you know where you know it was you know race and all that but pretty crazy but i do want to visit that uh, place today while we are in uh, tulsa oklahoma because that's where it actually took place back in the day so we are um actually driving right now about to head down to the wall street mural um, yeah, the traffic here is pretty crazy, so, but yeah, that's about to head to right now, um, and I think I probably want to take myself, like, on a date, um, real quick, and get some good food, but yeah, um, I will see you guys in a minute. Use the second lane from right to take exit. Okay, guys, so we are now at the, uh, Black Wall Street Mural right now. Um, and they do have a Greenwood Cultural Center that I do want to try out today. But um, I will give you guys the montage of how the mural actually looks like all of it. But it's absolutely stunning. Um, you know, my heart goes out to all the black people who had lost their lives in that tragic situation. Um, we will be visiting the um, Greenwood Cultural Center. If, if you guys are not familiar with it, um, we will go get some more history about, you know, the things that took place back here. So yeah, this is outfit of today. I have on this white button down. And then I have on these um, blue jeans with these little um, black little booties. And then I have my Teddy Blake that I'm wearing today. So that is outfit of today. Like I said, the hotel did not have any um, <laughs> mirrors, so I couldn't show y'all. But um, absolutely stunning. And then I have the um, Vernon African methodist uh church right here too as well so i'll definitely be sure to give you guys um, all the montages and um a little bit of history of um down here so yeah let's go
restaurant called the Big Whiskey. We about to go in here in a minute. Um, so yeah. my loves and welcome to a brand new day so today is actually wednesday tuesday <laughs> and um we have dinner reservations tonight at seven o'clock but i wanted to go out and do like some local stuff so i definitely want to hit like a goodwill and then also um i think i want to go to the mall but right now i want to go to starbucks first and then um we are going to head out so i am just for today i just have on like this little cute green dress i'll show you guys a little bit um in the bathroom mirror but yeah let's go ahead and go this is the dress that i'm wearing today it's just like this uh, olive green like um, maxi dress. It's kind of long. Um, and then I'm wearing like my little black booties. I have on this two chain little necklace from H&M. And then I have on my watch. And then I end up getting this little belt right here from Walmart. And then like I said, I am wearing my little booties. Um, I did try to curl my hair a little bit because I feel like it was a little flat. So yeah, this is the dress for today. I'll definitely be taking some pictures, but I'll be taking them wherever I decide um, that I'm going to go to. So, let's head out. Okay, y'all, so we are now at Starbucks. We got here quick. So the Starbucks is actually, well, it is a Starbucks um, close to, oh, they got the grilled cheese. I'm about to go crazy. Um, it's a Starbucks next to um, the hotel that we stay in. Like, literally, it's like a plaza, like, right next to our hotel. It's, like, so convenient. Like, I love it. Hi, how are you today? I'm fine, how are you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. Um, could I get, let's see here. Well, first off, do you, um, do you guys have the uh, grilled cheese in today? The grilled cheese? Mm-hmm. Uh, let me double check. You okay. Get one okay, thank you. Thank you. So, I want this drink that I just got hip to, but it's so good, y'all. I had it when I was in the city, but I'm gonna try it again and see, like, if I really like it, because I feel like if I really, really like it, then it's gonna be a thing forever. So y'all, um, I'm definitely trying this drink again for the second time. And this Starbucks is so cute. Wait a, hold on, is that a different restaurant? You know what, we might be going to lunch over here, but the thing is, is that y'all, I wanted to um, go to the mall after I leave Starbucks today and um, you know and then obviously hit like some little local spots too as well because we leave tomorrow so yeah all right the girl who made my last one y'all she made it so good like oh my gosh it was so good I think that's why I liked it last time because it was so good when um, the other girl made it but yeah I'll show you. I will. I think I already showed y'all, but um, yeah. And then I got a grilled cheese, which I pretty much get the same thing all the time. Um, but I did just get hip to this ham and Swiss um, sandwich that they was that a beat? Uh, oh no, uh uh, <laughs> wait a minute, baby. When I see a B, 
I get in defense mode, y'all. I got stung by a bee at my auntie's house a couple years ago, and I had allergic reaction. Ever since then, me and bees do not get along. I promise you, me and bees do not get along. Like, and it's a bee right here by the window. Like, mm -mm. thank you, thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you. So uh, she was extremely sweet. I love sweet people. Like, wow, they give me life. So this is the um, little drink that I'm loving right now. And then I have a grilled cheese as well. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and probably park for a second just to sip my drink and just take a bite. And then I think we're gonna head to the mall area. So yeah, I'll see you in a minute. Cute and moody, like I love it. Like the aesthetic is super cute, and I love the fact that the building is like all black and inside. Yeah, so cute. But I'm about to go ahead and try some food. Um, we are doing like a little solo date today, um, but I do have dinner tonight at seven o'clock. So we still gotta go to the hotel, get dressed, and stuff like that. But I still want to hit like a Goodwill um, when I leave here, and then after that, I go back to the hotel. So, but I'll show y'all a little food and stuff. But yeah, it's super cute. Wow, and it's in Tulsa, Oklahoma. It's called Kazama. Kazama Raymond Bar. So, yeah. Let's enjoy it. Okay, guys. So, I am trying this um, jalapeno pepper stuff with crab meat and some sauces and stuff. It's different. And it's like, it has like a fried little bottom. Yeah. So good. This is how it looks. Amazing. And this is like fried. Yeah, it's so good. Like, mm. so 
so good. I'm gonna try another appetizer, but it's gonna be like a little bit of everything. They treat me so good in here, y'all. dinner at the mahogany um our reservation is at 8 30 but this is the dress that i'm wearing which i got from jolie she um, i actually did a clothing haul and i showed this dress so this is the dress that i'm wearing and i'm going to be wearing these um little black heels um i have uh, some simple accessories i have this really cute necklace i just got um and it's does to go with it with my watch and i'll probably be wearing my teddy blake bag so let's head out Hey guys and welcome to a brand new day. So we have made it home safe from Tulsa, Oklahoma. I really enjoyed my trip. Um, so right now I did just finish getting dressed. We are about to go out to dinner tonight. Um, just to grab some food for tonight, for real. Um, and just catch a little bab. Um, so I will show you guys what I'm wearing. I pretty much already unpacked and stuff like that. I didn't show that because I'm sure y'all didn't want to see that. But um, I did finish unpacking and organize the house and stuff like that. Got everything together. I am out of the shower. I feel good. I feel better. All that traveling kind of just exhausted me. So to say the least, I'm happy to be home. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing and then we're gonna go ahead and head out. Okay guys, hopefully you guys can see. I had to turn the light on because 
Obviously, it's getting dark outside, but I have on this white turtleneck that I got from Walmart. It's just like a cute, like, long sleeve turtleneck, and the material is really nice, and these are very affordable, too, if you guys would like to get it. They have them in multiple colors, black, white, brown, and cream. And then I have on these black jeans, which are super, super dark, is why you really can't see them. And then I just end up putting on my little black booties um, for tonight. So this is tonight's fit. Like I said, it's a pretty dark outfit. So it's kind of hard to tell, but I hope you guys can see. And then I'm pretty sure I'll be wearing my Teddy Blake. And then I have my watch on with my necklace. And then I'll probably be wearing my Teddy Blake purse. And then also the perfume that I end up wearing tonight is this new it by Zara. And then I end up wearing Ambry Saffron. So yeah. <laughs> Hey my loves and welcome to a brand new day. So guys, in today's video, we are going to run some errands this morning. Um, I am actually wanting to probably go to Starbucks first. Um, I am dressed for the day. I will show you guys what I'm wearing. Um, also, I think I want to hit a Target and then probably go to Ulta. And then I also want to show you guys what I ended up getting from some stores when I was in Tulsa as far as like for the fall and just like some little pieces that I picked up to go with like other little pieces that I've been collecting um, recently. So let's go ahead and get started. So this is the outfit for today. I do have my black one piece on that I end up getting from Jelly She. I do have a coupon code if you guys would like to purchase this. Also this jacket right here, it's like a light color, like cream, like pea jacket. Um, and I just took the belt off of it because I just didn't kind of want to go for like that coat kind of look. And then also I am wearing my black NYC purse right here. And then we keeping it real comfy and casual today. So I have my little black little um slides and i end up getting these from walmart they kind of are like the ug dupes but they're just like these cute little black slides um i thought this outfit was really cute and chill and i just love the pop of color of cream i just think it looks super cute and the weather today is about i want to say um 50 something degrees so it's not actually going to get that hot today so i think this is actually the perfect little outfit so this is the outfit of today now let's head to the car it is a beautiful day today thank you jesus we just want to thank you for this day father god and thank you for waking us up this morning lord and we just ask you to continue to watch over us and our family father god and continue to direct our path in jesus name amen won't he do it <laughs> thank you jesus who i appreciate you father um so we have to go ahead and head out for today um beautiful day thankful grateful just blessed in more than ways than we know so yeah but i'm about to head to target matter of fact i'm gonna head to starbucks first indian target but i'm loving the new lens i hope you guys are enjoying it um you know as far as getting like different angles etc um i feel like the camera quality is kind of different too but um, i do think the camera quality do look a little better in my opinion i don't know maybe i don't know but i think it looks really good so i hope you guys are all doing well today and i hope you guys are um safe and healthy in your family so let's go
okay my love so we are now back at the house and i wanted to show you guys what i ended up getting from the stores today we ended up going to burlington target and alta and then also i want to show you guys what i ended up getting from the woodland hills mall when i was in tulsa because i did go inside of an h m and they had some pretty cute pieces so i want to show you guys what i got let's go ahead and get started okay guys so the first thing i want to start with is just some hygiene stuff that i ended up getting from really target um and Burlington and then I also got a few candles so that's what I'll start with first so the first thing that I ended up getting is this Dr. Teal's sleep spray um I have heard some really good reviews about this I wanted to use this to see if it actually helps me sleep better at night and if it just gives me a better night's sleep because it does says um promotes a better night's sleep so I'm super excited to use it it's like a I think lavender let me see I guess it don't really have a smell to it it's some type of smell but it's like it's not really let me say it's like a mm, i can't explain it but it's like between like it smells really good it smells like something that's like real misty so i'm actually very excited to use this it is the sleep spray with melatonin and essential oil so it says it's new but um it is by dr teals and this is the first thing that i end up getting I actually got this from Ulta and it was $6.99. Guys, lately I've been using um, brow gel and um, mascara gel. Y'all, when I say it makes a huge difference when I be doing my makeup and stuff, like literally, especially with my lashes, like my lashes is like, like naturally long, thank goodness, because I don't know how to put on false lashes, but um, it like make your lashes like almost come alive. Like it stretches them out and it also uh, make your mascara like just kind of like look fuller and stuff when you actually use this and then also with the brow gel you can use the brow gel to kind of like shape your brows and like kind of keep them in place um all day so i did end up getting this clear brow and lash mascara gel this is how it looks and this gel is actually by elf as well these are only three dollars at ulta i would highly recommend if you guys um like to have your brows looking very um fine and very put in place as well this is actually this is really good for like those little hairs that doesn't like to lay down on your brows or like those hairs that um do not like to curl correctly when you're doing your mascara and stuff like that so yeah highly highly recommend this and you can get this at also for three dollars okay guys next i end up getting this one this eye on beauty it is a pro callus um remover and i end up actually getting this from burlington for 4.99 this is actually how it looks right here super cute it's like in like a black color and i got this because i want to start actually um removing callus off of the back of my feet whenever i'm in the shower and i'm doing like my shower routine etc i think what i'll do is i think i'll just actually hang this inside my shower that way it's just already available for when i do take a shower um and stuff like that it'll already be ready but yeah i got this from burlington and it was 4.99 okay, something else that i got for the shower and it's crazy y'all because i've actually i have not had one of these well i've had one in my lifetime but i haven't had one lately and actually when i get in the shower my hair actually gets wet even though my hair being braids because obviously i wear wigs and stuff but yeah i ended up getting me a shower cap this actually came from target and it was 4.99 it actually says um it is a double lined double-sided waterproof shower cap and it is a satin line it's by Cantu brand which is a really good brand but this is how it looks it's actually in gray it's really cute so it's in like a gray color then it says one size fits most this did come from target and it was actually five dollars this is how much it stretches open so yeah got this from target and it was actually five dollars because the other one they had was in like a pink color and i didn't want pink because i'm not a pink girl chrome kind of look and i'm like yeah that's what i need i want you guys to comment let me know like what do you guys use to uh clean your tongue or like if you guys really clean your tongue um a lot of people think that when you clean your tongue that mouthwash is supposed to clean your tongue like that's probably the craziest stuff i've ever heard but y'all people be out there thinking that mouthwash is supposed to clean your tongue comment below like do you use mouthwash to clean your tongue or do you use a tongue scraper i've been using a tongue scraper for years now but i went to target and i found these tongue um cleaners and they are actually disposable and it comes in a pack of 32 and they were very affordable i think they was like 349 because the one i got um it's, it's like a plastic one but like you can kind of like reusing it 
but what i love about these is that like you can use them and you can go but this is how they look right here they're like tongue cleaners and it is by the brand grin so this is a brand and like i said it's also um in target and they are a pack for 32 and, and this is how they look in the bag instead of like reusing like my regular little plastic one which is don't get me wrong like it's like a nice plastic but i just i just feel like i would like these better because um you can just throw them right away and the packaging is so cute they just look so cute i'll be a good advertiser don't I? this is the next thing i got from target the next i end up trying out this new um body wash i was actually looking for this body wash for a while and they were actually out of stock it's by the method body it's in the coconut rice milk and she butter simply nourish and it says plant-based cleaners plus good vibes inside so this is how it looks so this is the method cleaner and i'm really excited because i have heard good things about it it actually been out for a while the girls was using this a lot when it first came out on social media um i just didn't jump on the train right here and there because i had other stuff that i was using at the time but i want you guys to comment let me know if you guys have ever used this before but i'm excited because it got the rice milk in it this wash in particular i want to say was 6.99 i think yeah so it's not it's not super cheap but it's not overly expensive because i feel like ten dollars is too much for a wash so 6.99 that ain't bad but like i said they held this at uh target it smells really good too i ain't mad at it i'm actually excited because the smells that it's giving it's giving a fall vibes it's giving a coconut it's giving a creamy yeah i'm excited for this okay guys so next i end up getting this tahitian pomegranate and coconut milk for renewed glowing skin it is a exfoliating it is by the brand caress it's for body wash and it is a 25.4 ounce this is how it looks and y'all when i say this smells so good i am very excited to use this the bottle is so aesthetic i love this now y'all i found this at burlington for 4.99 now if you guys notice this is actually the bigger one um they do have one smaller so i knew when i seen this jumbo one i'm like this is the biggest one because the other ones um and i actually have one in there i actually have the um the cocoa butter kind i think like a glowy skin one too as well um but it don't have this lid this is like the pump lid so this is actually the biggest one that you can actually get in this brand right here and y'all i had got this from berlin sam for literally 4.99 i don't know if i told you guys but i always get like stuff like this from berlin sam or ross it's always cheaper than going to target um walmart etc you would always get that discounted price so definitely check your local ross or burlington for any type of wash especially dove because they always have dove in there too for super cheap as well and i like your little dove sprays deodorant and stuff because i also like to use um dove deodorant sprays too um for deodorant i don't actually use the um like cakey deodorant anymore it's just uncomfortable and it always leave like white stuff up under your arm so yeah it smells really 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 good i'm very excited for this it smells so good and it's like a it's like a red color too so this had a look and it's like an exfoliator so yeah i'm excited because it smells so good y'all yeah got this from burlington for 4.99 i wanted to get a candle for my bathroom for when i do like my little self-care etc um and then i also wanted to get me another candle that was for like the fall vibes and stuff like that because pretty much all the candles in my house right now are like kind of smelling like fall so i just want to get one more to go inside of my room and then also another um different smelling type of uh ecliptus type of candle to go inside my bathroom so so the first candle that i have is a fragrance number two it contains essential oils this is the cashmere comfort rich and warm and creamy hand poured and finely crafted richly scented candle it's in the flavor paper white um and it's really cute and aesthetic um this did come from burlington and this candle was actually um 6.99 but i thought it was really cute and i actually like the font as well and i just feel like it's giving those fall vibes and it smells really really good i love anything cashmere if you do not know i love anything cashmere when i smelt it it gave me oh my god this smells so good oh my god y'all this smells so good this smell better than i thought wow wow i can live in this 
they smell good y'all um and like i said it's in a cashmere comfort super cute came from burlington um 6.99 it looks kind of small from right there but it's actually not too small and i like the fact that it looked like a frosted like um little candle really really cute and chic as well so yeah i think i might put this in my room because it's really gonna get a five vibes okay guys so the next candle i end up getting is an ecliptics scented candle it is by heaven street candle company it is in this very very elegant um very very elegant um candle container really nice you guys know when i seen that black i said up oh, she sold <laughs> So it has this really cute like very modern looking super elegant sleek little top and it actually comes off and it has a little rubber thing in the middle to actually stay on there and i just liked it the shape of this candle too as well i just thought it looked super super pretty and i just love it and it was something about this candle that just stood out to me um i like the fact that it's square because i feel like i have not had a square candle like this so i thought this would go real cute in the bathroom now the reason why it's eclipsed this is because I kind of like these type of smells when I be in a bathroom, you know, in the morning, doing self-care, shower, whatever. I like these type of smells in the bathroom when I'm actually doing it because it kind of just gives you like a fresh, very calming and just very relaxing type of vibe. So this is in the Ecliptics and it smells so good. It is actually, is this a wax candle? It looks like a wax candle. This was actually $7.99. The font looks so cute. It matches my aesthetic to the tea, especially in the bathroom, but it has a one wick in there. Okay, so yeah, I thought this was really cute and I'm gonna actually put this in the bathroom and this came from Burlington too as well. Okay guys, so now that we are done with like the skincare, hygiene, beauty products, I wanna show you guys some items that I ended up picking up from the H&M in Woodland Hill Mall because they have some cute little stuff and fun fact, everything that I have was actually on sale except for these little pants that I ended up getting from Target which I ended up getting recently, so yeah. So it's one pair of pants from Target, but I'm gonna show you guys those today as well. And then the rest came from H&M, so let's get started. H&M bag right here. I think the first thing I'll start with is like t-shirts and stuff. Like I said, everything I had got from H&M was actually on a sale. So I've actually been wanting to get one of these type of shirts. It's like a silk kind of shirt. And I feel like the type of shirt that it is, I feel like I can actually wear this out. Some of them just be looking too much like pajamas. I did get this in a size large. This was actually on a sale for $12.99. The original price was actually $24.99. Okay. So it's like this really cute, like creamy um, little silk tank. I just think this is absolutely stunning. It is like a very elegant type of vibe. Um, like I said, I've always wanted a shirt like this. The material is very, very gorgeous. But I've always wanted a shirt like this. I think this would pair really good with um, these pants that I got. But you can actually just pair this with so many things. You can pair this with some jeans, etc. Like I said, the material is like a silky material, so it feels really nice. And the quality is definitely top notch. Um, to me, H&M just really carry those really good quality clothing, in my opinion, is why I will always shop there. Now, I haven't shopped there in a while, but I think this um, little piece that I end up getting from there is actually really, really cute. So I want you guys to comment and let me know, do you guys own like a silk shirt like this that you guys um, have in your wardrobe too as well? So I thought this was really cute. And I think this is like a real cute with like some little trouser pants, um, with like some nice little um, booties or like a nice little heel. But yeah, super cute. And I got it on a really cute sale. And I just love how it got like that creamy um, color as well. I like that it has like a little cut right here so i think it's going to fall on me very very gorgeous so also when you wear these type of shirts uh, i would recommend to wear um the little um covers over your uh, chest instead of you know like a bra because obviously if you wear a bra it'll look tacky so um if you are ever wearing a shirt like this just wear the little covers um and make sure they're like a black or brown or skin color um and it should look very elegant on you so yeah this is the first thing I got. So the next thing I ended up getting is this long sleeve shirt. This was actually on a sale too as well. Uh, this was actually for $12.99. Let me see what the regular price was. They actually got the regular price covered on this one. But let me see if I can find it. The regular price on this shirt. I don't say. Well, they got it covered up. So, hmm. I don't know. It could have been like 
maybe 20 but they got the regular price covered i can't even see it but it was on a sale for 12.99 i just ended up getting this really cute black um it's almost like a linen like material but you can definitely wear this black um shirt in the fall time you guys know that i love black button down long sleeve shirt so just how it's looking very chic shirt and i just like how fitted it is on me i did get this in the extra large and even the extra large just kind of fits um but obviously these run pretty small very nice and chic you can pair this with a pair of jeans etc you guys know that i love these type of shirts it is just so cute i love the way that it fits but as you guys can see it's like a very not really thin but just like a linen type of material because you can kind of see through it but i feel like you can still wear it in the fall time so yeah this is kind of like how it looks and i love the sleeves as well okay guys so the last thing i ended up getting from h&m y'all i found this really cute like oh my god i think it's like an olive green um color but just like on a lighter side i found this really cute sweater dress y'all it's so fire like i tried it on it fits and y'all i had got it on a sale and this is when you know you done got lucky because when i was um out shopping on the floor i seen this same dress but it wasn't on sale yet y'all the regular price of this dress was 25 dollars, and i got it for 12.99 okay so it is like this really cute um maxi like dress but it's like you know but it's like a sweater dress and it just gives you the fall vibes look at this dress y'all look at this dress like look how cute this is it's like a sweater type little mini dress and when i seen this dress i was like oh my gosh this is so freaking cute and then the fact that it just had that like olive color i was like yes yes and yes like i said it goes about this long but it's not too short but you can still wear this in the fall time so stunning and then actually it has like a little back part and the back is like a little low but it fits so 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 cute and i actually love the straps on this dress too as well and this came from h m and then like the detailing pattern on it like looks like this like so it just gives you like that sweater type of vibe for the fall season it looks so cute and i actually love these little straps too as well and then the rest of it just has lines through it so yeah super cute i know it looks really short but it's actually not that short it's actually still like a classy amount um of length on here but just stunning like i love this just to kind of give you guys the more like fall outfits but like more on like the classier modern side uh, my last haul was more like a trendy type vibe which they was cute but you know obviously my style is different and it's just more classy and just more um i don't know just more elegant that's just my vibe so yeah i will show you guys how i pair these together now the last thing i want to show y'all is actually these little pants um that i end up getting from target now i've always wanted some of these pants um these are in a brown color these were actually 25 dollars, and i got these in an extra large really cute and it's like these really cute like stretchy like pants and it's actually the pants that has like the little slit on the side i forget what they call these pants but they're so fire like this is how they look they were at target for 25 dollars this is how they look and it has like a line on them and it has like a really nice stretchy material and it has a line in the back right here it has a line in the back and then it also has a little slit right here on the side as well super cute it's like these like stretchy like long pants but they kind of flare out at the bottom so they kind of flare out at the bottom and they have like a cute little like slit on both sides and this is how the back looks right here they really fit very very nice and like i said it is like a stretchy like material so it's really really nice these are by the brand a new day and they were actually 25 dollars at target okay guys so that's everything i ended up getting from the store so i hope you guys all truly enjoyed today's vlog i know it was like two separate like not really two separate vlogs but 
you know, like I, I was out of town in Tulsa, then I came home and I vlogged. But I wanted to give y'all some really good content. I wanted to, you know, make sure that, that the video was long enough for you guys. Because I know you guys are used to at least 40 to 50 minute videos of my content. Um, and I actually enjoyed the long vlogs too as well. I want you guys to comment and let me know. Do you guys like the long vlogs or should I do like more like 20, 30 minute vlogs? Comment and let me know. I enjoyed my trip to Tulsa. It was really nice. I needed to actually take a break and... I just wanted to switch scenes real quick. Grateful to be able to do things like that and just grateful to be able to have certain people in my life that can actually be there to share with me too as well. So um, I hope you guys all enjoyed my trip in Tulsa because I definitely did. Um, and then also just like everything else that we did as well, the shopping in the hall. That is going to conclude today's video. I want you guys to give this video a big thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. It helps out my channel a lot. And I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.